Age is not an issue when it comes to losing weight. Although most people over 40 years of age experience some changes in their metabolism, this doesn't mean they can't shed a few pounds. Be sure to watch the entirety of this video to find out how dark chocolate can help you lose weight. Are you going into your late adult years and looking to cut a couple of pounds? These are the best weight loss tips if you're over 40. Vegetables will be your best friend. Start with veggies first, then build your meals around them. Nutritionists usually recommend using one full cup of non-starchy vegetables at breakfast and about two cups for lunch and dinner. A minimum of five cups a day will provide valuable nutrients and offer disease protection. But these vegetables are also going to make you feel full, improve the volume of your meals, help control blood sugar and insulin levels, and boost healthy digestion. These benefits will be key to achieving sustainable weight management. During breakfast, pour a nice amount of healthy veggies into your favorite fresh smoothie. Later, fold some cut-up zucchini into oats, add vegetables to an egg or chickpea scramble, or just eat them on the side. Some good options for this are sliced cucumber and red bell pepper. Instead of having the usual sandwiches or wraps at lunch, choose salads or bowls that contain a nice amount of healthy and nutritious veggies. For dinner, the best options you'll find are sautéed, oven-roasted, grilled, or stir-fried vegetables. Try to make these the most notorious elements of the whole meal. Just like we mentioned before, combine your veggies with any element rich in protein, good fat, and reduced amounts of healthy carbs. If you follow these instructions correctly, then you will most likely achieve an ideal balance for both weight management and good nutrition. Stay away from alcohol. It's very tempting to sit back and relax after a hard day and pop a bottle of wine open. The problem is, before you even notice, you've already had two or three glasses per night. Most wines contain about 120 calories per serving. These calories are very sneaky because they're easy to overlook. This means that after a few generous glasses, you've already ingested over 400 calories. And this doesn't even include the meal you had before. Try to cut some of the alcohol in your diet. The ideal amount is one five ounce pour a day. Cut back your alcohol by 25% and you'll notice how a couple of pounds simply drop. But if cutting out drinking all at once doesn't seem real to you, consider trying with a specific drinking strategy. Cut back gradually, limit alcohol to weekends only, or curb your consumption to one drink per day max. Get familiar with the mats. As we age, our bodies change, and it's important to prepare for that change. Experts recommend yoga as a hedge against the aging process. Yoga's benefits are already well known by many. It increases flexibility, strengthens core muscles, reduces stress, improves circulation, which also has potential sexual benefits, and can improve the quality of sleep. Most people have sedentary jobs and have tightness throughout their bodies, including hamstrings, hips, lower back, and even chest and neck from sitting at desks most of the day. Incorporating yoga into your lifestyle can be life-altering. It's a mind, body, and spiritual experience that helps clear your head and strengthens the body like no other workout. The best part about yoga is that it can be done at home at the convenience of your leisure. There are plenty of free options through streaming services and videos on YouTube that guide you through the movements if you have never tried it before. Don't let diet food fool you. A lot of 40 plus people remain stuck in outdated weight loss mindsets. One of them consists of eating diet foods, but these are highly processed products affected by artificial unknown chemicals with the intent to be lower in calories, carbs, sugar, or fat. Most experts recommend leaving out this whole section for good. Aside from being absolutely unsatisfying, diet foods can mess a lot with your appetite, provoke inflammation, harm the healthy bacteria in your gut tied to weight control, and overwhelm your immune system. Some studies show that changing from processed foods to organic or whole foods improves calorie burning. This means that consuming real food can help you lose some pounds even without regulating your calorie intake. Instead of a low calorie frozen meal, opt for a hearty lentil soup and an avocado topped salad. In place of a few reduced fat cookies, reach for a sliced apple dipped in almond butter or a few squares of high quality dark chocolate. Healthy sustainable weight loss isn't about dieting. Deprivation and go on, go off approach ultimately backfire. Instead, adopt a mentality of balance, meaning not under eating or overeating with a focus on nutrition, not restriction. It may seem boring and it's not a quick fix, but it feels best both physically and emotionally. And this approach is maintainable. 
Sleep as much as you can. A natural way of stimulating human growth hormone production is getting enough shut-eye. During sleep, the brain releases human growth hormones into the bloodstream. This occurs during the first stage of sleep, but during middle age, the body produces less HGH. So if you're in that age bracket and not sleeping well, your efforts to maintain a healthy weight will be compromised. Don't skimp on sleep. Enjoy a small amount of dark chocolate. Using some dark chocolate as a daily treat helps reduce the need for both sweet and salty snacks. Dark chocolate can also be key to lower stress, which is a main emotional eating trigger. One study proved that eating about an ounce and a half of dark chocolate per day for two weeks lowers levels of stress hormones in people who claim themselves as highly stressed. Five squares of 70% dark chocolate contain under 250 calories, yet provides antioxidants, fiber, and magnesium, a mineral tied to relaxation and improved sleep. Try to keep the room cool. In our 20s, we might be keeping a keen eye on the thermostat for financial reasons. When you're in your 40s, you're usually in a better financial situation, but being less frugal might contribute to your stomach. A striking study published in the Journal of Diabetes suggests that simply turning down the heat in winter may help us attack belly fat while we sleep. Colder temperatures subtly enhance the effectiveness of our stores of brown fat. This fat keeps you warm by helping you burn through the fat stored in your belly. Choose your snacks wisely. Being 40 means that you can have a lot to contend with over a given day. Always be prepared for a busy or unpredictable day by keeping healthy snacks on you, at your desk, and in your car. Experts suggest having almonds or other unsalted nuts, apples, bananas, chia bars, protein bars, or other fruit and nut bars close at hand. Nutritionists advise that if you have to skip breakfast, lunch, or even dinner during your quest to look your best, you can keep your energy levels up while making healthy choices. You'll have no reason to run to the vending machine for chips or stick your hand in the candy bowl. Tie your shoes. According to nutritionists, a key element of your strategy for getting fighting fit at 40 is to increase cardio workouts and to do them in a fast state. Hit the gym and do some treadmill sprints on an empty stomach to burn fat. Your body is already in a calorie deficit and it will ignite its fat burning ability. Glycogen levels are depleted during sleep, so your body will utilize a greater percentage of your body fat as an energy source. Don't hurry up to cut carbs. Carbs are fuel, and whole food sources like fresh fruit, whole grains, and potatoes are bundled with vitamins, minerals, fiber, and antioxidants. Cutting out carbs completely deprives your body of important nutrients. This can lead to unwanted side effects like constipation, fatigue, and irritability. But after age 40, your daily carb requirement may decline. Many people find that they can't eat large carb portions without either gaining weight or struggling to lose weight. The best resolution is to optimize the quality of the carbs you eat. Say butternut squash or overprocessed bread and think of carbs as a smaller add-on to a meal, rather than the main attraction. Turn off the TV. After a hard day at work, it's tempting to zone out in front of the TV. But did you know lean people watch less? A recent analysis of studies found that for every two hours spent watching TV, the risk of developing diabetes or heart disease and early death increased by 20, 15, and 13 percent respectively. Scientists are still figuring out exactly why sitting is so detrimental to health, but one obvious and partial explanation is that the less you move, the less fuel you require. The surplus blood sugar floods the bloodstream and boosts diabetes and other weight-related risks that crop up in the 40s and beyond. Leave a comment with what you think is the best method to lose weight after you turn 40. See you next time!